say it's scary because we have never ever um, even have a, a category two storm. Certainly this year is un uh, unprecedented. I've decided to come here because um, with this weather system at a category four and its location, I am not taking any chances with it. I prefer to be here, write it out, and then tomorrow we'll see what happens. Did you have concerns as relates to your home? Well, the last weather system that passed Barbados was not even at a category one. And I saw like, the galvanized at the back lifting and trees swaying in the, in the wind and things like that. So it looked very, very, very dangerous to me. And then the water started to build up on the road as well. So I know if, if a Category 4, I know we would have a lot of damage in that area. So I decided not to stay. This is the Lloyd Erskine Center Center. Currently we have approximately 87 personnel or shelters in the shelter, which is made up of 45 males and 42 females, one of them having to be at least three and a half months pregnant. Uh, can you give me some details as relates to your preparation uh, for this particular hurricane, as well as the supplies that you have on hand? Okay, well, um, leading up to the shelter being open as a shelter, we basically did some shelter and securing, um, installing the shutters, the windows, preparing um, sandbags to be placed by the doors just in case you have um, a, a flooding so to avoid water having to get inside the building, placing the sandbags by the doors. Um, basically setting up the room to accommodate the personnel. Um, yeah, basically have everything in place to accommodate the numbers that we have at this time. You've decided to seek shelter here at George Lamming Primary School. Tell me why. Yeah, well, the first thing, it's close to where I live. I live right in Carrington Village. I just think where I live, well, it's pretty safe, but I think here, much more safe, safer than, you know, staying at home. So I just feel in my spirit to come, you know, here and seek refuge with the family. You speak about your family. How many persons are with you? Uh, myself, my wife, and six kids. My wife, we were planning to stay at home, but you know, I just got up this um, a few hours ago, and I feel I told my wife, well, she was a bit reluctant, you know, in coming, but she said, well, I told them, well, I think we should go, you know, you know. I'm not scared or anything, I just want to be on the safe side.